There is a huge warning message right now, and I definitely want to tell you about it. This is going to affect millions of Americans across the country. Yes, in fact, things are going to get much darker within the next couple of weeks. Uh, yes, guys, this is not nothing that you need to be worried about in regards to being dangerous, but it is something that is very important because we have an official solar eclipse that is happening uh, less than two weeks or so. Take a look at this right here guys darkness from april's eclipse will briefly impact solar power in its path we are talking about this solar eclipse that is about to happen which is sort of a lifetime event that only happens multiple years decades and decades uh, from the previous one now those that don't know the last solar eclipse or half a solar eclipse that we actually saw was around 2017 and here we are about to have one of the big biggest, if not the biggest one that we have seen thus far. Yes, we are talking about being able to see this from the United States, specifically from my home state of Texas. For those that do not live in the state of Texas, hey, you guys are going to miss it potentially uh, depending on where you actually live because Texas is going to be the best place to actually watch this solar eclipse take place. Uh, but anyways, uh, a lot of questions in regards to this. When is it going to happen? What time is it going to happen? Well, again, guys, less than two weeks away, officially it's going to happen on April the 8th of this year. Uh, yes, I believe that is on a Monday. And I do want to share these details with you. Uh, it says that what time will the eclipse be on April the 8th of 2020? 24. Yes, it is going to start at around 2 o'clock, uh, 2.07 p.m. to be exact, on April the 8th in Rochester, New York. Uh, the moon will begin to appear to move in front of the sun. Totality begins around 3.20 p.m. and will last for 3 minutes and 38 seconds, plus minus a few seconds depending on where you are standing uh, by 4 33 p.m. the moon will have moved past the sun returning the light to normal. Now again, those particular times in regards to Eastern Standard Time. So obviously I live in the state of Texas and it is going to be one hour before these particular times. So here in Texas, uh, things are going to begin around 1 p.m. And I am so excited, guys. I have already gorded my glasses and they are here. Uh, I'll tell you about that in just a minute. But uh, are you guys going to participate in per uh, watching the solar eclipse? Do you live in a place in which is in the pathway of this particular solar eclipse. Uh, take a look at this right here where it is showing the United States and you can see the path in which it is traveling through in Dallas, Texas, which is my home area, DFW. You can see that it is going to be crossing directly in its path. So it is going to be right above us. For those of you that want to travel here and come stay with me for a little bit, please let me know down below in the comment section. I would love to have you and partake this solar eclipse with you guys. But uh, anyways, guys, a lot of schools are really planning on watching this. A lot of different organizations, jobs and things of that sort. A lot of people have taken off. And in fact, some people are actually traveling internationally just to come to Texas to watch the solar eclipse. This is one of the largest anticipated events that we have seen in our time. Again, guys, you need to be participating in this. I'll give you some information at the end of this video, so make sure that you stay tuned. And if you haven't already, go ahead and hit that like button right now for me. It really helps out. Now, in regards to the state of emergency, uh, that is true, guys, because we have the Niagara area in Canada. They are declaring a state of emergency, and they are doing this, not that there is any danger right now, but they are doing it in advance as a cautionary ahead of the rare solar eclipse that is going to take place. As you can see right here, Niagara region declares state of emergency out of caution ahead of the rare eclipse. Uh, yes, we are talking about Toronto, 
Niagara region area has proactively declared a state of emergency ahead of the rare total solar eclipse on April the 8th that is expected to gather massive crowds to the areas in and around the region's popular waterfalls, Niagara waterfalls. So uh, anyways, the Niagara region said in a statement on Thursday that the regional chair, Jim Bradley, had declared a state of emergency out of an abundance of caution. That is the only reason, guys. So if you live in Canada, don't be alarmed. But if you are planning on visiting this area, uh, they might have a little bit extra security. Uh, but anyways, declaring a state of emergency strengthens the tools the region has at its disposal to safeguard the health and the safety of its residents residents and its visitors and to protect our critical infrastructure in any scenario that might arise at this particular time. Again, guys, like I said, this is a huge thing for the United States. And guys, I did a little bit of research because the previous one that we had, which wasn't a total eclipse, actually happened in 2017. And here we are seven years later and we are about to have a total eclipse. Now, in regards to when is going to be the next eclipse? Well, guys, shockingly enough, it is going to be in the year of 2044. That is almost 20 years away. So you definitely want to partake in this particular time uh, because this is going to be one of its kind. So uh, this is why I'm making a video about this, guys, because you need to make sure that your kids, your children, your family members are able to participate in this because it might be the last time that any of us will actually see this happen ever, ever again. Now, again, like I told you guys, in regards to you need to have uh, these particular solar glasses that are actually approved by NASA. And uh, there are a few companies that are actually giving away free Eclipse glasses. Uh, yes, this might interest you because otherwise you have to order them and it's going to cost you a little bit of money, not necessarily a lot, but a little bit of money. But there are a few companies that I want to share with you that are offering these glasses for totally free. Now, again, I have not uh, double checked these particular companies because they might have actually run out of the free versions of these. But just so you know that there are many, many glass places that are actually giving these away for totally free. Uh, once in a lifetime event, guys, like I said, uh, everybody is going to be participating in this. So uh, make sure that your glasses, your Eclipse glasses are safe to use, guys. You don't want to ruin your eyes. Uh, so that is very important. Uh, but again, I'm trying to scroll down here and it says the first company on the list that uh, might be giving away a pair of ISO certified glasses starting on April the 1st. Uh, that is on Monday, guys. So you need to set your alarm to participate in these. But Warby Park is giving away some of these uh, solar eclipse glasses. Uh, that is awesome. The dates will be available between April the 1st and April the 8th. Uh, you can get up to two pairs uh, for your family. So that is some good news. Also, uh, Warby Parker has uh, brick and mortar stores in some areas. So check to see if you live near one of those. And then also on their website, Warby Parker, they have provided a guide on how to create your own uh, sunglasses or your projectors to use. So again, another place that you can get these for free is My Eye Doctor. Uh, that is a company, I believe, and they are giving out free solar eclipse glasses. Uh, they have around 438 participating locations around the United States. They are actually available right now, so you can reach out to them to see if you can get one of these free pairs. And then also Jenny's Ice Cream. This is a Columbia, Ohio-based ice cream brand. So for the, some of you out there, you know about this, but uh, they are giving these sunglasses away starting this past Thursday on March the 20th. And they are going to be giving them out through April the 5th. That is in store. So obviously those individuals that live in Ohio, you can participate in getting some of these free uh, solar eclipse glasses. Again, those are just some of the locations. Be sure to Google what's in your local area to see who's giving out free glasses. And then again, uh, I do want to tell you about if you do not have any money whatsoever, don't fret because there is a, a DIY option in which you can create your own <laughs> potential solar eclipse glasses. It says right here that if you don't have eclipse glasses, you can still enjoy it through indirect ways, such as making your own a uh, pinhole projector using some household materials. Uh, yes, you definitely want to take the time to look in your house 
for uh, a piece of card stock or cardboard. I'm sure some of you have that out there. And then poke a really tiny hole through it, uh, through the piece of cardboard or card stock paper. Hold it up during the eclipse. Hold it up like this, guys, and look down to see a partial uh, croissant projected uh, below. Uh, yes, holding up a colander or a cracker will produce a similar effect as well. Another trick is peering at the ground under a shady tree can yield crescent uh, shadows as the sunlight filters through branches and leaves. Eye experts are warning against viewing the eclipse through a phone camera. The sun's bright rays can also damage a phone's digital components as well. So do not do that, guys, especially if you have one of the later models of the iPhone 13, 14, or 15. Those things are more than $1,000. Do not ruin your phones by doing this, guys. It is very important. But anyways, guys, it is just easier if you have a little bit of money and you want to order the official uh, uh, solar eclipse. Eclipse approved glasses to be able to uh, participate in this event in its totality. Uh, guys, you are in luck, guys, because I did a little bit of research and out of everybody selling these solar eclipse glasses, guys, I have found the ones that I think that are the best. And these are uh, available on Amazon.com, guys. And so far, this particular person, I mean, they are selling a ton. It says right here that 100,000 of these have actually been bought within the last 30 days. So uh, anyways, guys, like I said, I have gone through the pictures and uh, looked at the information right here and I'm definitely recommending it to you. Uh, so if you have around $20 plus some taxes, uh, you can order a pair of these for you and your family. This is a 10 pack. So think about it, guys, a 10 pack for $20 that literally comes down to $2 per sunglasses. And you can keep these and you can use them uh, if you're still living during the year of 2044. You can still use these uh, during the next eclipse season uh, that we are having. So uh, anyways, guys. I will include a link to this Amazon uh, listing or whatever you call it for $19.99. But guys, we don't know when they are going to sell out. Like I just told you, it looks like they have already sold over 100,000 of these 10 packs of solar eclipse glasses. So you definitely do not want to wait. Order yours right now. As soon as you finish watching this video, guys, the link will be down below in the description. Uh, but anyways, guys, I just wanted to share that information with you because this is a huge warning because you need to prepare, guys. Do not allow your children, your grandchildren to miss out on this event. It is huge, guys. Once in a lifetime. I mean, come on, guys. I necessarily wasn't excited until I started reading all of the information surrounding this and finding out people are traveling all the way from Ireland, Australia, uh, Paris, Europe, the UK, traveling to my home state of Texas just to partake in this huge, huge event. So I would definitely encourage you guys, I would invite you guys to come to my local state as well. Uh, but anyways, if you do come here, please stop by and say hello to Budget Bill. But uh, anyways, guys, if you have any questions, please address them down below in the comment section. If you haven't already, hit the like button on this video. It really helps out this channel. Also, if you get a little bit froggy, share this video as well with other people. But also guys, if you haven't, subscribe to the channel and I hope to see you guys on the next video. Thank you.